Hello there, friends. It's Dylan, your favorite. D I N O S A, you are a dinosaur. And welcome back to my channel, or welcome to it for the first time, if it is your first time here. We love first timers. Hi. <laughs> I think we're about to be, um, slayed. I don't use that word very often, but. I think it applies. I think I'm about to be slayed. I'm hearing so much chatter. I'm hearing so much noise, so much gossip, so much praise for this comeback from Idol called Tomboy. I think it's a big hit. It's number one in Korea right now. And I need to find out why. So we should check it out, right? Just checked out Red Velvet's comeback and it was okay. It was fine. It was lovely. It was sweet. It was nice. But I'm ready to be like physically moved. I'm ready for a song to make my ass bounce. Do you know what I mean? And I feel like that's what this is going to give me. One of the teaser images for this release is um, the girls in... I want to say pink camo? Pink and red and black camo, I think, maybe. But they have bazooka guns, okay? They're ready to shoot us all down. They also have really creepy smile masks on, which look fake. I think those were added in post. Um, but either way, this picture is just a fucking serve. I don't know, I just have a feeling that this is gonna be great. This is gonna be what I want in my life right now, okay? At the same time, I don't want to get too excited because I didn't really love their last single. It was the first single from them that I didn't love, Hua. That song was super forgettable to me and it was disappointing because I was just expecting too much, I guess. And here we are again, I'm expecting too much from them. Um, but I don't know, I have a feeling. I have a feeling it's gonna be served to me the way I want it, okay? Hot fucking dish on a platter. I'm too excited. Do you hear the words that are coming out of my mouth? This is embarrassing. I think it's time we stop talking about being excited and actually experience the excitement. Let's watch Idol. Tomboy, let's go. No, I messed up. Are you ready? Let's go. Let's go. We are, oh, I think it's just a street. It looks like a giant pile of uh, blended up berries or something. But it's just the street. My eyes are playing tricks on me. We're just on the fucking street. Yeah? Where are we going? Is her hair pink? It is. Oh my god. Look at you. I am looking at you. Look, my toe, my accident this video is already great. Why are you is this like rock? You I love her voice. Okay, walk towards me, bitch. Where are we going? My deep voice queen. Her waist looks so good. We're not playing ping pong. I like to add, drinking whiskey, I We're drinking whiskey? Y'all, this is not what I was expecting, but it's still a serve for sure. <laughs> oh my God. Yes, triplets. Lick it, bitch. Okay, we're dolls. Oh, we killed him. Nope, just kidnapped him. Oh, this looks so good. Yes! Oh, he died. Because he came here in that trunk. And when we opened it, he was gone. We buried that fucking body. We threw it in the river. Kick me. Oh my god, okay. I'm obsessed. Oh, we're at the movies still. This video deserves fucking credits. That was so good. Oh, there he is. Okay. Cool. Did anyone know it was gonna be a rock song? I didn't know that. But I'm not mad at it. I'm, in fact, quite happy. That was lovely. Okay. Shit. I'm so thrown off just because um, 
the song. The structure of the song was actually totally what I was expecting. Like if you actually break it down piece by piece, it sounds very much just like an idol song or an idol lead single, I should say. But the instruments they chose, it's fucking rock music, okay? There was guitar. Something about me just really appreciates that this song didn't rely on uh, trendy sounds and sounding like everything else that's out right now. It had its own identity. It was, it was, I don't, I'm happy. I would love to know how the um, hardcore idol fans feel about this one. Is this something you're okay with? Are you okay with them just switching up how their song sounds? I do not mind the switch at all because at the end of the day, the song is still structured how it should be and still very catchy, but the influences instrumentally are just so cool, okay? I loved Miley Cyrus's last album, Plastic Hearts, and she went kind of in the same direction. It's pretty cool. The music video on its own was also so lit. It was so cool. I loved it. I love when you can tell like the director of the music video really tried to get cool shots and had an idea of what he wanted one girl to do here, here, and here. And it's not just like the camera stayed in the same shot and they just cut around it. No, that camera was moving, okay? Things were happening and I appreciated it. Um, Update, I totally did not realize that uh, Idol lost a member. I did not realize this. Uh, Sujin is gone. When I see her face in these pictures, I'm like, yeah, that's a member of Idol and she wasn't in that video. But I was just so enamored by the beauty and the glory in front of me, I didn't notice. N nothing against you, Su Sujin. Sujin? I'm probably saying it wrong. Nothing against you, glorious girl, because I do remember you, but, um, uh, the girl still slayed without you. Uh-huh. Let's watch it again with subtitles on. I think I caught that a large portion was totally English because I understood a lot of what they were saying. So let's uh, turn on the subs and see if I was right. Oh my God, I love it. Let's go. Yeah, Are they supposed to be saying I'm a fucking tomboy? I think so. That's badass. That's We're in the kitchen. Got it. We are putting together the recipe that poisoned him so we could kidnap him and put him in the trunk. Got it. Oh, we're blending him up alive. We baked him into a cake. Right? She looked so chill walking away from that explosion. Oh my God. This is a tricky law law. I can't get it down. <laughs> The queen. No, we're not the fucking queens. We're tomboys, all right? Oh my god. Love it. Still 10 out of 10. Okay, y'all. My thirst has been fully quenched. My hunger has been fed. I've been fed. You know that platter I was talking about earlier? They loud it. <clears throat> they loud it. I can't speak. They laid it out for me and I ate it. Okay, I ate every crumb. Lyrically, the song seemed to be just about the fact that we don't need to meet your beauty standards. We don't need to meet the standard of whatever you think a woman is, okay? Don't even call me a woman. Don't call me a man, don't call me a woman. Call me a tomboy, okay? Because that's what I feel like right now. And there ain't nothing wrong with that. Fuck you, I'm gonna put you in a trunk and kill you. 10, my friends, 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. I have a question though. Can y'all answer something for me? Because I don't know what's going on. What is this show called Queendom? Queendom 2 featuring Taeyeon as the host and Idol as a participant. What is this? What's going on? I don't get it. Luna's in it too. I don't know what's going on. Should I watch this? Is this important? Should I film my reaction? Should I make it a series on the channel reacting to the show? Or is it not going to be worth it? Because it seems like it might be worth it. There's lots of hype for this show, but I have no experience with it. I didn't watch Queendom 1. I don't know what, I don't know what's going on. So please tell me if that's something you'd be interested in or if I should just watch it on my own time and it's gonna be worth watching or if it's gonna be trash, I don't know. All right, what did you guys think of Idol Tomboy? You loved it. Please tell me you loved it. I don't want people to not like it because then they won't experiment like this again. And this is an experimentation done right, okay? I approve of everything I just witnessed. Love it. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see the uncut version of this reaction, as well as all my other uncut reactions, those are posted over on my Patreon. Link will be below. Damn, that was good. 
That's it. Goodbye. You tomboy bitch. Bring the ball.